Hey folks, how you doing today? So this just came out of the shop. What this is is a 1950s Nips perfume vendor. Very cute piece. This is all the original plating on it. As you see, napkin holder would have sat in the diner. And here is a place for the, uh, the menus, okay? Uh, come on up here, Jeff. I just want to give them a look here at, uh, at the little bit. This is, these perfumes are so cool. You can find these on eBay, but if you look here, you see these are little glass tubes of perfume. And they called them nips because you took them out and you snapped one in and then you would just put it on your hand and put it around your body. Four in each one. These here are all full of nips. I was able to, I don't have any product inside the machine. I just don't, ha I didn't have any more of them. But it has a nice representation of all of the nips and all of the different uh, flavors or scents, okay? This is how you select them, and this is how you operate it, right? 25 cents. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pull this here off. Let's see if I can get this out. Original coin box, okay? This slides out. And then here is where you load them. This slides out. Okay, and then in here is all the different compartments for all of the different perfumes. And you do have to pull up these little spring-loaded gizmos here in order to load it. As you can see, it's in very nice condition. It has got very little use. And uh, for you guys who keep buying coin-op stuff for yourselves and you want to get your wife going, this would be a perfect little starter to see if she wants to get into a little coin-operated stuff. They do, uh, here's perfume, they have lotion vendors. There's lots of neat things that a lady would like to put in her bathroom, etc. Anyway, just a great little piece. I'm going to give you a little close-up on this. Okay, These are the little bottles. Very cool. Four in each one for a quarter. Once again, these are all the original ones and they all have the product in it. Anyway, great little machine. Get it for the girl. Maybe get in there some coin-op stuff. Anyway, thank you so much for your time. Okay, Jeff, what do you have to say? I, I guess it's probably inappropriate, but I would say that it seems like it could be a uh, self-ready device for a lady of the night, perhaps. I don't know. Maybe. These are antiques. These are mantiques. Antique. Mantique. These guys sell mantiques. This is their store. We're picking. We're bringing stuff every day in and out, in and out, in and out. We're, we're, we're shaking and baking. These are their customers. Give me the rundown on the GMC. This lived in a bar in Ghent in Belgium. Follow Jim and Jeff from 9 to 5 or after hours as they buy, sell, and restore the coolest stuff for the coolest collectors worldwide.